Hi, Amy. Chef Leo here over at Lambeau Field, uh, cooking up another tailgate party favorite. Uh, today what I'm doing is a warm bacon vinaigrette. It is by far one of my favorite salad dressings. Um, it's just, it's, it's got bacon in it. How could it not be, right? Uh, it's warm, uh, wilts that lettuce a little bit when it goes on, and it's just fantastic. So I'm going to show you the dressing right now. So I've got a pan here going pretty hot. I've got a little bit of olive oil. It's actually an olive oil canola oil blend. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and add my bacon. I just need a little oil. I just want to kind of start the rendering of the bacon, but I really want to utilize all that nice bacon fat that renders out of here. Okay, next I'm going to add my chopped shallot. Um, if you don't have shallots or you can't get shallots, uh, just a, a yellow or even a red onion would be fine. Just do a nice fine dice on that. Okay, shallots cook fairly quickly. Next I'm just going to add a pinch of garlic. Garlic. We don't want it to be overwhelming, but we just want a little, just a little hint. Okay, next I'm going to add uh, brown sugar. Now really the, the idea here with the brown sugar is you want the brown sugar to dissolve and all the bacon fat that's in, the, that's in your pan. So go ahead, about a half a cup of brown sugar, and you really want to get that kind of dissolving in, into that dish. And just a little more brown sugar. Once you make this once, you'll know uh, how important the brown sugar is. It just uh, adds such a great flavor to this dish. Sometimes I find myself putting a little more brown sugar than I'm supposed to because it's so good. Okay, next, um, we've got an apple cider vinegar. Go ahead and add that. I highly recommend using apple cider vinegar. Just the apple flavor pairs really well with the bacon and it really is a, a crucial part of this dish. So once I got that cider vinegar in there, um, I just need to cook it, basically deglaze it with that just for a couple minutes. You got this nice golden brown sauce here with that uh, brown sugar in there. So next, what I need to do is I need to blend this. Uh, if you've got a home blender, that would be fine. Just be careful when blending hot liquids. You only want to fill it to about a quarter or just under a half. Um, I've got a little hand uh, mixer here that I'm going to use. And we just want to go ahead and uh, blend this down into more of a liquid form. Okay, now we are uh, going to mix it in a little bit more, make sure it's the texture we want. I'm going to add just a little bit more brown sugar. We really want that brown sugar flavor to come through here. Yeah, that looks really nice. Okay, go ahead and turn our heat off. Um, I just got some greens here, some grape tomatoes, some red onions. I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit of my dressing. And you know, this one's really up to you. You can uh, puree it as much as you want or leave it as chunky as you want. You still get that great flavor. Go ahead and toss this up. And there you are, you got a nice fresh green salad with a warm bacon vinaigrette.